Hello everyone, welcome back to Tech Trends. In this video, we can see how to use Gemini AI in ESP32 board. Let's get started. Now go to Google and search for Gemini API Docs. And click on this link. Here, click Try Gemini 1.5 in AI Studio. Here, click this Get API Key button. Here, create a new API Key. Click on this button and it will create. So, here we need to create a API Key in a new project. So, this is the API Key. Copy this key. And this is our program. So, here we need to enter the Wi-Fi username, Wi-Fi password. And here, paste the API Key. And this is the program. So here this is the URL. So we can check this URL whether it is returning the data or not. Copy this URL and we can check this in Postman. Download and install the Postman application. Now open the Postman application. Here paste the URL. Here we need to pass the API key. This is the API key. Copy this and paste in the URL. Now here we need to select post and also go to headers. So here we need to add one more header type, content type. And here select the value as application slash JSON. Now go to body. And here paste this program. So we need to enter our question here. So I am entering the question as tell me about Steve Jobs. Here click on the send button. So here we got the answer Steve Jobs visionary innovator. Steve Jobs was an American entrepreneur, etc. So the API is returning the, returning the data. Now we can check the output in the ESP32 board. So this is the program. So first select the board here. The port is already selected. Click on that and select the board ESP32 dev module. Click OK. Now click the upload button and upload the program. Now the program is successfully uploaded to the ESP32 board. Now we can check the output. Now open serial monitor. So now we can enter the question. We can ask the same question what we checked in the postman. Tell me about Steve Jobs. And press the enter key. So here we got the same answer what we get in the postman. We can see try some other questions. Tell me about ESP32 microcontroller. Yeah, here is the answer. So likewise you can try multiple questions. Hope you understand this. If you have any clarification, please mention in the comments. Please like this video and subscribe to Tech Trends. Thank you.